Welcome one and all to T Who's Talks. I am T Who's and I will be talking about Yu Gi Oh! Uh, what I'll be talking about in general is archetypes, single cards, maybe even show you a few of my decks, you know, just general Yu Gi Tuber stuff. So, yeah, howdy. Uh, I thought I'd start off today with a nice, easy to discuss um, archetype of the Symphony Gins. Now, for those of you who don't know, the Symphony Gins, the Symphony Gins came out in started at XC Symphony. Um, there is another extra deck gin which these guys support. It's not really part of their archetype called Queen Dragon Gin, who came out in Galactic Overlord. Uh, yeah, but I won't be discussing her really, except for now. Well, I'll stop discussing it now. Right. Start off. I'll talk about the big. Well. I say big beta. I'm talking about ten tempo, the percussion gin. Uh, yeah, he is a rank three fiend Xyz monster, earth attribute with 1,700 attack and 1,000 defense. Its effect is once per turn during either player's turn, you can detach one material from this card to target one Xyz monster your opponent controls. Detach one Xyz material from that monster, and all face up gin monsters you can. Tr currently control gain 500 attack. It's a nice card. The fact that you cannot activate it in your opponent's turn only adds to its usefulness, you know. And the attack gain is permanent, which is also nice. So, say your opponent already had an Xyz monster out, you detach the material from it and beat over it. And next turn, they summon something to try and beat over you, like, I don't know, Utopia. Uh, you just detach t material from that as well, and then they can't beat over you anymore because you'll have 2700 attack by that point. So it's like the anti Xyz Xyz card, if that makes sense. So yeah, uh, that's 10 tempo. It's super as well. Woo. Uh, yeah, on to Mellow Melody, the Brass Gin. Uh, she's not as big a beater as 10 tempo, but because she's only got 1,400 attack, but she's got 1,600 defense, which is odd because her effect is quite aggressive. Uh, it's once per turn you can detach one Xyz material from this card, target one Jin X e Xyz monster you, you currently control. This turn, that monster can attack that twice during the each battle phase. So yeah, uh, yeah, she's good. She can inflict 2800 damage if she can attack directly twice by herself. Or itself, it's a card. Uh, yeah. But it, only re it works better when combined with Ten Tempo or Muzo Rhythm. Which I'll talk about in a second, but yeah, also super, very nice. And it's light attribute, so it works with honest. So you can beat over a big monster, you drop honest, you know, and then beat over something else with the same amount of attack that you gained. So yeah, inflict quite a lot of damage with that. Uh, next up, we have Muzo Muzo Rhythm, the String Gene, a wind attributed fiend exceeds monster, also rank three. Uh, its effect is during the damage step when a, a Jin Xyz monster you control is attacking an opponent's monster. You can detach one Xyz material fr from this card. The attacking monster's attack is doubled until the end phase. Effect of Muzo Rhythm, Muzo Muzo Rhythm, the String Jin can only be used once per turn. 1500 attack, 1000 defense. It's like a mini Honest, if that makes sense. It's more like, I don't know, limiter removal for the Jins. If that makes sense, but you don't destroy it in the end phase, and yeah, uh, it can beat over three thousand, over anything with less than three thousand attack by itself, or if you have moves or ten tempo out even, uh, you can beat over anything with less than three thousand four hundred, and yeah, he's pretty cool, and also he's got a good nice guitar, so he's pretty cool by himself. Uh, yes, on to the big. Boss man, as it were. Uh, My stroke, the Symphony Gin, a rank 4 Dark Fiend Xyz monster. Requires two level 4 monsters, and its effect is once per turn you can detach one Xyz material from this card, target one face up attack position monster your opponent controls, change it to face down defense position. If a, monster, if a face up Gin Xyz monster you control would be destroyed, but you can detach one Xyz monster from that Xyz material from that card in, monster instead. So basically it provides sort of gachi gachi or zen mains is protection to all of your gin monsters as well as having a book of moon effect and decent attack, well decent defense not so good attack 1800 
got 2300 defense, that's nice. He's the most widely used gym monster, also I believe, because, you know, Book of Moon's good, Gachi Gachi Protection's good for itself, even if you don't use the other gyms. So yeah, as you can see from their effects, they all work well, well, work better when together, but that's the problem, you don't really have more than one hour at a time unless you can protect it for a turn, which definitely in this format is impossible with, you know, Insectors, Dark World, stuff like that. They're going to get slaughtered, basically, unless you can really, really focus on protection, which is why you don't really see a deck focusing on them. But uh, they're good. Uh, I tried making a deck once focusing on them, but, you know, a rank 3 spam deck that just burn through your hand and you know it's kind of difficult to uphold and get anywhere with it and uh, most people don't use the rank 3 gyms because there are better options you know like zen mains or leviathan which is a shame really because you know they're, they're decent they're not brilliant but they're not rubbish so yeah that is the discussion of the gin extra deck well the symphony gym archetype as it were as I'm going to call it uh, yeah so that's it for this video. I uh, hope you've enjoyed it. Please, you know, comment on tell me what you want to see next time. Uh, like and subscribe, please. You know, thumbs up. Well, I can't really. Yeah, yeah. it's hard to see because I have to set the camera and dodge it. Anyway, enough chitter chatter and babbling on. So, before I make an even bigger fool of myself, goodbye.